Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm Louis. I hope you're having a good summer and a good summer festival. So we have ongoing uh, on Facebook and, and web uh, the summer festival event. And you can get some some rewards with this. Uh, basically, in exchange for, for the hunting that you can get from multiple missions, you can you can then uh, go in the merchant and get some some goodies here so some some skin stones some stuff for your pets uh some some soul stones uh the, oh, the dolls that open up into multiple things and and then the items so red and uh, and um and orange items so uh, and also the purple items so you you have um quite a bunch of things you can pick uh, personally I'm probably going for for the items, but that's that's possibly for another video. <laughs> I'm not going going to be opening opening rewards today. Um, so let's let's see um, one of the most larger quests here <laughs> to call it this way. I think it's here, Life of the Party. So you need to gather up to one thousand soul stones. And I'm going to explain how you can get uh, this the easiest and most efficient way. So uh, souls, as you know, you can get from from the campaign. It's one of the ways you can get it. Um, the the recommended way would be to looking into your heroes and see uh, which ones you don't have yet to six stars, and then you try doing uh, those um, those missions to get the souls so you can advance those those um, those ones that, that are more important to do the your your main heroes in my case i'm still working on astrod in this account on the facebook account so i need 20 more souls and so I, i've been doing this every day now uh, with this event to get to get souls uh, even at this point doing the <laughs> the chapter 2 and 5 which don't give me anything useful but yeah it's a way of spending energy to get uh, exactly the souls that i need uh, but i'm not, not just doing those so i'm 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 doing the the one i do every day so chaplain 9 for aurora to get me uh, this type of things here and then i'll do astrod i'll do heidi and i also did all of them here and and then i'm also doing tia and then i see okay what else can i get i can i can also try helios I can also so heal you to get some of these more interesting items here, like the the alchemist sets here and these things here, etc. And then you also have uh, Phobos, which also has some interesting items in here. Um, another way of seeing this is just go in the campaign and and then I mean, if you have all all, all your main heroes already at six stars, you can just uh, you know scroll down from up down or down up <laughs> or left right right left whatever direction you want so what uh what i do after i get all the souls that i need uh, for the main heroes i go in here and i start from chapter 13 i don't usually do 14 sometimes i also do 14 but i start usually on chapter 13 then i go all this way down here until i run out of energy so i use the some energy bottles i use the two cheaper uh, energy reload so you these ones but at 50 emeralds each and then i just go through all the energy that i can in a, in the most effective cheaper way and i try to get all these orange items because i'm i'm much in need of orange items but also some purple so i i do more the orange on these occasions and then the purples doing the the normal days without missions unless i also need oranges so yeah one of the things you can get here is the oppressor's crown you know you have a bunch of things here that would be interesting like lightning like the light of the 10 stars <laughs> and the spear spears of power and so on so this is one way of getting the souls another very effective way is going in the shops and using the coins uh, that you don't need in mostly uh, to get souls for heroes that you might need or the ones you need and then at some point even the ones you don't need okay so getting up to 1000 souls it's it's a lot of, of uh, work 
and one way of speeding it up is is going here and, and expanding so i would get i would recommend you know if you need for example Gulfus or ishmael or marcus or Liam, yeah sure go in there otherwise might not be the best way of spending the 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 granary uh, coins but this is a way and uh, definitely the tower is fairly inexpensive so you can you can just spend like the arena and uh, not always you get you know you do get some red items here uh on, on all of them but um not always you get the items you want <laughs> on these shops so arena and tower are a bit more uh, easier i guess to 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 just spend you know um less less uh, worri worrisome to spend those coins grand arena i think is a, is a, a bit more more challenging to save up coins so and sometimes there's good items in here but i definitely would keep uh the ones from the soul shop the friendship shop and the outlands shop uh especially so the soul shop you know if you want jet and y and you still don't have him at six stars you know you just go there and and buy no no problem but once you get to six star jet don't buy anymore otherwise it's just a waste the friendship shop um it's a bit like the grand arena sometimes you will have nice items in here uh, quite often actually um, but you might also need faceless and cornelius for different things here and there so it's not a waste until at least they are at six stars uh, and the outline i really don't don't recommend pushing these ones unless you need those heroes or you're desperate to get some souls uh, that's basically what i do i just avoid spending here unless really necessary so i got the organ yeah six stars okay but then i just uh, avoid spending so that's what i do you, know, you see here i didn't spend today anything here i spent here i spent in there for jet i spent what i had him here and in here uh, at this point i'm just trying to spend and uh, to reach my goal uh, uh, quickly and and because we, we only have now four days so I'm trying not to miss out the the rewards but um, at some point i will slow down and then eventually stop okay so we we looked up uh, at a campaign the merchant uh, there's a few more ways of getting souls so another way is through these uh, dolls and other similar uh, chests and things like that so this can open up into into multiple souls and then uh, we have uh, a few more um, options And then we have one last that I'll that I'll demonstrate. So one of the other options is actually going here in the Titan Valley in the Merchant, and you can uh, exchange your your certificates for uh, souls of of heroes that you need. Um, so I did spend uh, one one certificate today on Nebulus because I had her at uh, like. 298 souls out of 300 okay so okay i'll just finish this today for this account and i'll get nebula to six stars and i'll just spend one though i'm i'm still quite unsure what to do with all these uh probably would end up spending in these ones here the artifact coins in the large skin stone chest and avoid spending but if i would pick uh, uh for my case heroes to put uh, these on uh, it would be just and barry at this point because i don't want or need kark i already have sebastian and nebula six stars leaving and very as an, a good asset to have but um i'm, sti I'm still a bit quite af uh, far from from starting to put real effort into and so at this point it wouldn't be that much of a uh, necessity and I guess I'll hold up on the, on the others but this is a way of getting uh, some extra souls uh, you also have uh, you also have uh, this one here no sorry what am I doing what am I doing the guild war yeah merchant which also shows on the other side but I didn't cover uh, and so you can get you can get some some souls here for Jew, for Arachne, Yasmin, and, and Viri. Um, I don't really need or want any of these. I got my Yasmin on my Facebook account already six stars long ago. Jew on the web account also 
six hours long ago and the others I'm really not not into and so now well, I prefer to be honest I prefer uh, um, saving up these resources for something else and that would be e evolving your uh, Titan totem so they can be evolved with either those coins so bronze and silver and, and then so I cannot see this one but bronze and then silver and then gold coins gold and um, gold trophies and so this is where I just uh, hoard up and, and save up <laughs> to, to spend eventually and try not to spend on other things so last but not least we have also the soulstone chest right and these ones you can you can open you can get either 50 or 100 and you can pick the, the hero that you want to, to get the souls for and that's basically it so you just you just pick one uh, and you get where where do you get these you get so i've been asked this the other day you can get these on the daily bonus so at every 28th day you can get up to two uh, of these depending on your um if you have vip status or or not i mean if, if you have you get two if you don't you get one at level 10 <laughs> which is not uh, cheap but you can get uh, uh, those boxes containing up to 50 okay and then these uh, these ones here 100 you get on on special events basically as reward so now that we cleared that up uh, and we we went through some of of um, spending two dollars today on on the shops let's see where we are we are at 212 on this account and on the way up we need an another close to 800 to to 1000 and so let's open some <laughs> the fun part getting our phobos dolls opened up so we will get some some souls but also a bunch of other things i'll just speed up from now on So we were at 212. Well, let's let's try to understand how many we got. So these open into multiple. And that's that's why uh, dolls are are actually interesting and nice. Uh, for a while, they will keep opening up into more, into more, into more. All right, Phobos are done, and we got. Oh yeah, I cannot see how many directly. I will just keep opening and we'll do the math at the end. I could not see because I already had souls. <laughs> so I didn't know how many I had before. So now we are op opening the Lean dolls and they are opening into more. And we are also getting uh, experience potions, which is nice. At least at this point in the game for me is nice. I still have some some of these holes to to develop. <laughs> Oops, I clicked on the wrong thing. And also did I see I think I saw uh, hero artifact pieces. Alright, those are done. And we also have these demon dolls as before. Let's see what did we get so we had 212 and now we have 323 so that's about 100 so nice um, next up um, we can go directly to these demon dolls these tend to give if I'm not mixing up things with the mobile version uh, a lot of gold and also a lot of uh, Celeste Soul Stones occasionally so, so far we didn't get any gold I mean we got a, a bit a bit of gold there and the other time before but this didn't work out very well alright uh, 
Now we have interesting things here that I kind of forgot from previous events. Ascension season box contains gold, various coins, and other valuable resources. Let's check this out. So it's just Ascension stuff. Okay. All right. This won't matter for now. And we have also the storm legacy chest we can also open this though this shouldn't contain any any souls this, this should contain i mean for heroes it might contain souls for pets uh, but no harm done in opening this i guess we'll get plenty of gold i guess yeah some gold in there Alright, uh, I don't see any pet souls actually. I think we're supposed to get some, right? No, possibility. Ah, no, wait, wait, wait. We get instead the eggs, and then we can get the souls from there. So, okay. So we don't get this the pet souls directly. Alright, opening this all of. Um, yeah, I guess I can save some of this because of the eggs for future events. Yeah, I'll save some of this. All right. Now we see, we check where we are. Okay, we, di <laughs> we didn't get any more. Uh, yeah, yeah. So we still need about 700. And, and now we're going to work uh, on the more um, calculation part of things. So... So we have uh, here uh, 2 times 100, that's 200 souls, and then we have here uh, 5 times 50, that's 250 souls. So that's 450 souls. Uh, clearly not enough for the 700, that's why I keep spending uh, in-game resources trying to get more souls, because I really need to get it to, to do this every day uh, to get the, the most out of this. But now we can see which of my uh, heroes here on my team can benefit from getting souls uh, and thus or maybe some of them don't really benefit as much or they are not in, in much need but they will be more relevant in the future so that's something something we can uh, make calculation I'll, and I'll demonstrate a little bit so Astroth here I don't think it's worth putting souls because this is basically just a matter of, of days and uh, I mean if, if even if I just get one a day, one soul a day only, uh, that's 20 days, 30 days, fine, we can wait. And the same I can I can say about Heidi, you know, 22 souls, it's fine. But let's see what else we, and these are really easy to get souls. <laughs> and really not complicated and I, I really actually need some of these rings so I can just you know, press this button here and, and raid this during normal days instead of going for the normal missions that spend less energy. But this guarantees some souls and the items, and um, and I get so eventually I get the souls faster. So what else do we have as option? We have Thea, and Thea is a long way to go. Uh, we don't really have option of raiding for s for Rufus because you can only get him on the shop, on the Grand Arena shop. But we have Thea for sure. Um, about halfway to 300, so this will take a long time. Alvanor, we really cannot loot at this moment. Uh, Dorian, we cannot loot. Just the right chest. Uh, Helios, we can. We can. And I've been doing this a, lo a lot, so that's why it's gone far, although I'm not using Helios at this moment, but I plan to. Uh, but still, we are at about halfway, so it's, it's one option, like here right so Jorgen as I said already maxed to six stars then we have Cornelius 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 well you can you can get him from the shops so yeah would kind of avoid putting those resources in here unless you des are desperate then we have also very interesting options here we have Anvari which I showed on the other shop and those are a bit more expensive to get we have Martha she doesn't have uh, also loot or shop so we have uh, Phobos, which I'm actually using uh, sometimes. Uh, might wait as well. <laughs> oh yeah, there we go. 
<laughs> it went south. The crap items will be got on south. Um, but that might not be the one that I want to put those resources. And then we have Isaac, and for the future it might be an option. And also you cannot get him uh, that easy. So in my vision, it would be mostly Martha. Martha, so maybe not now Isaac, maybe not now Phobos, but maybe Martha, maybe Andvari, and maybe Hilmis, and maybe Kea. So that's the options. Um, now given the option, these options, so we see that we have about half progress done here. Oh yes, we have also have Dorian, of course. We have Dorian with the, and I might also add, we have also Alvanor as another option. So Kia, Alvanor, Dorian, Helios, Anvari, and Martha, and then for the for the down Isaac and Phobos. So it's a lot of of heroes to think about. Um, and let's now check what would be actually. And this is the exercise you could be doing uh, at your at your home for your your team. What would be the the most immediate benefit? So looking at this. And looking at what I also have in reserve here, so I can also swap here uh, Elise and Vari, Martha and Cornelius, and Phob oh, Phobos is actually out of the team. Um, but these are the ones that I have selected at the moment uh, in my third team. And then here we have Tia, who I also mentioned already, uh, Maya, sorry, Heidi and, and, uh, and Astrid, but we have Tia here, and she's on the second team. So She's definitely one of the, the, the heroes I should be focusing to, to get my second team a bit a bit stronger. But also we uh, we have also the, the, the very nice options of, of Alvanor and Dorian. So comparing these three, so the most immediate uh, visible benefit, the ones already on the team. So Dorian gives me a vampirism. It goes well with almost everything. You know, only only very um slow damaging but then mass damaging heroes like uh, satori uh, or the queens uh, they don't really benefit much from 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 dorian because they will do um, mass damage on one one hit uh, after charging up for a long time so dorian will not help them a lot they dorian will help a lot fast hitting high damaging Heroes uh, like Kira, uh, like uh, 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 Drew, Ishmael, and Heidi, even there. Um, those are the, the uh, Orion, goes very well with Orion. Those are some of the, the, the heroes that will benefit the most from Dorian. Also, Yasmin won't benefit a lot from, from Dorian because uh, she will jump. She will hit the enemy and then she will apply the the poison. I'm not sure the poison counts for vampirism, but even if it does, she also takes that time to jump. She needs to take damage. She needs to do, do dodging. She needs to uh, to score some some attacks to then be able to jump. And she also takes uh, some time to do that. Uh, not as much as Satori, I believe, but still some some time, like a mid mid uh, mid range timer. <laughs> I would say between Orion and and Dar and um, Satori and and Yasmin, I think she's in the middle. So that's an option. Can this team benefit from from Dorian? Um, not as much. Not as much. You know, uh, Alvanor, yeah, uh, Rufus, maybe Maya. I guess. But she will do poor damage. I'm not, sh I'm not sure this this counts. Uh, Jorgen, not really. <laughs> but can can Dorian help Heidi team for sure? You know Aurora and Dante. Oh, those two will benefit greatly. And uh, and if Heidi and her damage also works, then yeah, sure. Uh, what else? We have Alvanor. What does Alvanor do? Alvanor puts this physical shield uh, that blocks um, physical damage. Uh, I believe that's. That's the best description. We can look in here to confirm because keep confusing mobile with the with the, um, the browser version. So he absorbs basic attacks, which normally are physical damage. But a Celeste also does um, uh, a basic attack, but it's not physical. It's magic, so she probably gets uh, affected by this. 
and then you know he increases magic defense uh, i mean he, he decreases magic defense on the on the opponents and then he, he has these two skills for you know this one for healing and this one to boost the the that the, the other shield so he, he is an option to fight against mostly physical teams and that's why that's why i kept him here because um not only is a great healer but he blocks physical and then you can you know mix him up with with rufus and you're blocking magic and you're blocking physical you know that's an option and this team i uh, surprisingly does win um some matches and um, we see here that um exactly we won here in this case uh let's see we also won in this case you know the opponents and uh, they tried to to outsmart me and didn't get to that point there but they tried to outsmart me thinking that my third team is 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 crap but <laughs> then they get surprised in here again and sometimes i also surprise myself and i win with the with a third team as you can see there <laughs> also won there so it's actually playing quite well and then i also boost the healing with the um, with the oliver pad so i'm getting getting any much too much in the in details and then we have tia which does um tia, uh, tia does healing she speeds up your 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 uh, your heroes when they l reach a certain amount of lower health and then she also um she also applies the uh, blind or no it's I'm not sure it's called blind, but it's the 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 buff that uh, prevents uh, magic users from attacking. It's um, it's a vow of silence. So silencing, not blinding. Blinding is for physical. Silencing is for magic. For three seconds, they cannot uh, use their attacks, their special attacks, magic attacks. So, uh, yeah, which one? Which one? Which one? So, all three would be good, but the most useful at this moment would be either Alvinor or Tia, but probably Tia. So. I guess I can get here 150 souls, so 3 times 50. And maybe I can get here uh, another 150. So oh, maybe even the 200. I, I will be wasting a little bit, but uh, you know, it's not easy to get this, these souls. So I think that's the plan. So let's start opening things. I'm gonna get here. Ah, uh, wait, we have, we have only five of these so the math the math so let's do this we have we open here 100 for alvenor and we open 40 i think this is the better option looking for tia she's one of the older heroes so just go in here and select so one and two and uh, yeah, this one and three for Tia. So we should now have close to three hundred souls for Tia. We should have uh, one hundred more souls for Alvenor. So two hundred and six. And I think yes. I would say we open either two of these or one of these. Yeah, to make little more than 300 and we we when we are done with alvenor i guess we don't know when we will get another event so yeah i'll do this so another 100 for alvenor there we go i'm actually quite happy with alvenor although although i'm not really putting much effort into alvenor at this at this point so i left him at orange rank now we get him to six stars we have gold so a four uh three dot five K increase power increase or so. And and Tia she will be in the same stage as the other as the other heroes we mentioned, all Astrot and Heidi, and just a few souls from getting also to six stars. So the overall view is much nicer now. So six stars here, so now we have three here at six stars. Close to be another three heroes at six stars leaving now dorian and rufus and then the other bunch of people i have in there <laughs> so
to d to do gradual upgrades. Let's see this. And now we are 300, 300 uh, souls short of the target. Um, and this is where I will stop and I will uh, resume this, this planning in my head over the next days as I progress in the event, I see what else I can get, but we can do some calculations here. Imagine we can get um, minimum um, 500, oh, I already have 500, so I can get another one. <laughs> 500 um, arena coins here a day, maybe 1,000, so that's 10 souls, 10, 10 1,000, 10 souls. Uh, maybe, maybe here get, get also 1,000, so that's another 10 souls. I'm gonna get now Marcus, and then we can get another 1,000 here. That's 30, s uh, so 10 more, so 30 souls in total. 10, 20, 30. Um, I'm not gonna consider these. So, because you know this is completely variant, variable, and then and then I think we can get another one thousand here every day, so forty souls. So there you go. At forty a day, uh, easy, easy to get souls. So I'm not counting these because these are uh, more valuable for totems. I'm not, not counting these because these are more valuable for the skin stones. But at forty a day, with four more days. I expect to get 160, all right? And now we are at 684, meaning I can get till the end of the event uh, in easy ways, 800, uh, you know, already spent the stuff you saw, but um, can get up to 844. So I will need to come up with a plan to get another 150. Uh, probably that plan will be uh, spending, you know, it hurts, but spending one of these um, into into the the soul stone chest here for another one hundred. So that's definitely one plan. Then and then maybe spending these other two. I don't know. We'll see about it. <laughs> well, in this case, just one. We'll see about it. Uh, I still can get some souls from the campaign, but hmm, I don't think I'll get that many. Now, taking a look at the the web account. So the web account, I think, is in a, a, a bit better shape because we have a bit more resources accumulated. Um, as, as as such, you know, we, we, we did the same kind of things here. You know, getting the things that we need the most. Uh, still getting Rufus, this account, uh, and basically just about the same copy paste <laughs> um, we we still have dolls to open here as well and and we have a bit more of these chests and our progress is about the same as in the other count so in the other count we have we had 212 and now we have here 239 so let's quickly open these things up yeah and we do get we do get also um, artifact pieces for for heroes here on the on the dolls some gold in there as well so these are uh, i think dolls are quite quite better on mobile i have this impression i'm probably i'm probably right about this uh, i think we get a lot more souls on on mobile with these dolls so there those are gone already <laughs> Qu quick much quicker than on on the Facebook account that I just opened. Uh, we'll also open a bunch of these for no particular reason, I guess. That's enough. And then we have the demon dolls. And we got some Celeste there, you saw. I was too quick, but uh, we did get some, some Celeste dolls. And a few more there. And uh, that's um, that's it. So two hundred and thirty-nine, yeah, roughly fifty-two souls. Two nine one minus two thirty-nine, fifty-two souls exactly. Uh, meaning we need we need. Um, I mean, 
mean just close to 700 souls quite easy quite easy <laughs> so again the plan so we're gonna take a look first at the grand arena uh, and we can see here that um, Astrod is already done but we have lagging here we have lagging Isaac and Isaac has been losing his account we have uh, also lagging the twins because I decided to do the twins on this account um, not too long ago like a few months ago like maybe four months ago I decided to do this three months something like that and I'm starting to get good results with them and then we have Alvinor again and we have Drew so um, sorry uh, not Drew Rufus but Rufus is not really the the better uh, option here but Isaac would be definitely Tay would be Alvinor again and then we have the twins which we can get from the from the campaign that's where I've been getting them mostly but it's still a long way to go uh, um, well, I guess the best way would be just to go in here so let's see one by one one by one uh, Tia needing 220 souls so definitely we can speed this up by getting 100 more and Lars is uh, also about half we have Isaac quite far from the 300 so Rufus does not count here but he's far behind then we have Krista about half as well and we have Alvanor also quite far behind then we also have as reference we have Cornelius here approaching Helius about half and Martha also far behind and then we have as well Anvari alright so picking the ones that we need now this will be definitely Alvanor, Isaac and Tia. I should focus on this. Also the twins, but the twins they are progressing so well. These ones would be I mean twins twins versus Tia. There's a certain aspect here. I can get much more souls for the twins daily or in events. Because I need their items. The items that they have, you know, on the campaign. So Lars can get uh, the light of lifting stars and you know these are Poon Trident King and here the Asclepius and in here the Lycanthropus like thanks everybody needs Lycanthropus like <laughs> so I always go in there that's why he's speeding up very fast although I only started a few months ago uh, and in, in Krista we have here the spheres and these things that's not so useful uh, not, not so much you need rulers globus but the, the spheres are and these ones and, and also this one so these are all items any of them I need so <laughs> I just go in there all the time so probably I will get Lars and Krista done um in a in a short time of period like one another one month or two months maximum and if i wouldn't have an event to get these souls right now uh they will be done faster than isaac and alvinor so <laughs> you can guess where i will be putting resources alvinor isaac and then also Tia. all right so we needed about 700 right 700 all right let's start opening and uh, the first one oh we should check this properly so I think Alvanor and Isaac they were uh, like 70 each out of 300 Isaac 78 and Alvanor 77 all right so we start by getting uh, 100 for each 100 for <laughs> 100 for Isaac all right now we also have this one here it's the same but different item but it's the same result and we can get uh, I guess Isaac first if he yeah I think Isaac first you know for my second team we'll get Isaac so Isaac Alright, so we should add, we should have now 300 more souls, meaning we need 
another 400 souls or so and we can put a, a ceiling in there like don't get more than 300 out of all of this 400 now and we, we see the next days how we can get the rest and so we still have a uh, six to open here and six times 50 that's the 600 uh, no oh uh, 300 <laughs> what am i doing <laughs> in my head 300 so i guess i'll be opening five of the six or four of the six i guess i guess um probably won't have enough for all of them so we can we can start picking we can start picking so i'll pick isaac first and this will finish isaac Get Isaac, upgrade Isaac, evolve. Three K advancement or so. And in the merchant, we get this. All right. And now, <coughs> Alvinar. So Alvinar is about half, and Tia is about half which one do I need the most probably Tia which one is harder to get it's Alvinor can I swap Alvinor for Tia in some fight sure so we get Alvinor <laughs> that's that's um, it's just that huh? I think Alvinor is a better healer than Tia actually but you know, depends. If he's on a health team and the health team is very limited on on the web uh, on the browser version, is is more appropriate on the mobile version. But we need to get um, two hundred and thirty souls. So yeah, we don't have enough. If I want to save some of these, we don't have enough. But let's start. With that. So that's one hundred. And that's 150 half an hour. Oh, did I pass? Did I mis miscalculate? <laughs> I might have. Maybe not. Well, 3k advancement. And let's see. What did I do? What did I do? No, no, it's okay. So I spent exactly what I needed. And there's an extra surfer there, 27 out of 50. But I don't want to wait an eternity for getting more souls. So now we have we have Alvinor and we have Isaac. Finally, yay! <laughs> At six stars. And left to do is Thea and then the twin. And the and Thea is the hardest, as I as I spoke of these three. Because only one useful item, and not really. Because <laughs> I already have, you know, a bunch of these that I don't really need and use. A few, few heroes require this, so. And the other things are crap. So, yeah, I'd rather spend uh, energy on, on large increased emissions. And in here, use this type of things. And I have still two left. So I'll advance one more. And then I'll save the other one and see how it goes in the rest of these last days. So we advance to about the same as in the other account. So in the other account we were... Let's check. Um yeah, we put some stuff in here and now we are about uh, 15 souls of the objective and in here we are at 684 still lagging a lot behind. And uh, on the other account we got distracted. <laughs> that wasn't part of a plan, so we advanced a bit more than needed. 
and now we are at eight 841 I guess at this point I will stop spending uh, resources uh, soul soulstone resources like that and focusing on getting focusing on getting uh, stuff from the merchant stuff from the campaign but just enough to get to the point and then we stop uh, and our progress also you know it's a bit behind the other one 50 souls behind but it's not not too far I guess all right that's um that's about it I guess uh, nothing else to to talk about <laughs> to talk about here we have uh, we have a nice advancement um oh uh, we can we can actually see how many how many uh, of this honey did I collect so I collected a bunch more of course then you can press these buttons to get something out of this hopefully you'll get uh, some of those uh, honey hexagon summer festival coins so hopefully you can get some of these yeah one there so that you can then swap these for for items or for whatever you need <laughs> out of those things in there uh, I would wish I could, could get like at least six six of those coins in, a, in each account I only have five so far I guess one more would make me happy and then we'll see but I think in the past I've gotten I've gotten up uh, up to ten in one of the accounts and the other like eight so it would be cool to get as much as as in previous events in one previous event because this is one time a year and this account is is not that old all right um yay one two nice so one account five the other four nice <laughs> well that's it i uh, i hope you enjoyed this i hope you took uh, something useful out of this and that this will help you decide what 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 to do and how to do your strategy to get the souls you know we only covered one of the missions there are other there's other missions there's um and you can also quickly look at that but but you know this this will uh, you know this will some of these will be difficult uh, i think this is usually one of those that are or the one that is um, easier to do on the long term because if you manage your resources well and save up all those chests and gold and things then you can have uh, a, a, an advantage over this this quest and and get the most out of it with little effort like like we did now we, we, d we only spent things that i had accumulated and and bam we got we got progress well advanced in both accounts, especially on the on the web account. Uh, but you know they also have these uh, arena ones. These these are easy, you know. But it will only get you so much far. Only this amount of honey is not that much. Uh, and in here you always get this one at the end if you if you manage to get the one thousand. Then you have this one which is about finishing all the other quests in x number of times. Now uh, you have all lands, but it means you'll need to either do uh, increasingly more difficult fights in all land or spending emeralds. Energy. At some point you can progress for free, but then, or at very cheap amount of in-game resources without spending money, like, like I'm doing. And I, I don't recharge emeralds. Um, but then it will be increasingly difficult, like eight uh, 18,000 is a lot. Uh, of course, spending emeralds, which can <laughs> go almost infinite. Six 65,000 for me is, al is almost infinite. And this is, um, I guess, VIP status. And this is uh, every day. So, you know, you, you have some things to work on there, but I think the... The ones that are easier are energy and, and life of the party. And life of the party, if you do things well, you can just do it, do it without spending any 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 money. Well, I'll see you around. Take care. Um, leave a comment, leave a like, an unlike, a subscribe. You you know what you want to do. <laughs> Nothing if you don't want to do anything. Um, but I hope to see you somewhere out there. 
All right. Bye-bye.